We had looked at other places, and um, we knew right away as soon as we drove through. There's a natural calmness to it. It has a feeling of comfort. The whole place, uh, it emits a sense of uh, low country. Peacefulness, tranquility. This is an easy place to live. We had never lived in a, a community before. We were lived in the city. And you don't know your neighbors like you do here. We hadn't been country club people. We hadn't, we just didn't know this kind of life. plantation is one of Belfair's greatest gifts. The live oaks along the boulevard cause each and every one of us to sigh when we come home. You just slow down and you, you absorb it. I've never seen anybody who drove through the gate and didn't just say, wow. Puts a smile on your face when you come in every time. For some reason, when you come into Belfair, you get that sense of community, and uh, I, I think that's the feel that you get. And then you start meeting people and everybody's so friendly and so welcoming and uh, so glad to have you here. That uh, it's just, it's kind of a special place. It's just that spirit, there is, it is a community. They are always willing to help, do whatever, and it, it's just very unique. I wanna be around people that I love and um, that's very important to me. You know, we've made friends here in the, in the short time we've been here that no doubt will be friends for a lifetime. They really do care. It's, it's genuine. If you love golf, and I obviously do, <laughs> this place just grabs you immediately. The last seven holes on the west course lead out to the Colleton River. I don't think I've ever seen seven holes that are more magnificent. It's easy to remember different holes because they're all so memorable. And a lot of them are so different from each other. They each have their own individual characteristics. Very beautiful, and the two golf courses are completely different. The West Course makes use of some gorgeous marsh property as you come to the finishing holes. And also a natural lake, hidden lake. And then I feel the East Course is like a man-made miracle. But the real, the real credit goes to Tom Fazio and his people that work for him to be able to produce what you can dream about. I, I made an observation a little while back that uh, to Carol, I said, you know, if I never played golf again, which I hope isn't true, uh, I'd still choose to live here. I'd love living here. There is so much to be involved in, and there is also so much to contribute to. It's inviting and serene and family-oriented, all wrapped up into one. Pretty place, lots of water, beautiful scenery, great trees, everything's good here. You have to be here to experience it. This is a place I belong. I 
feel like I've come home and this is where I want to live. When we drive through the, uh, the gate, we always say, we're home. And that's really what makes it so special for us. We wake up every morning thankful that we're here. That's a pretty powerful thing to feel. And I think the vast majority of people here wake up thinking exactly the same thing.